Hello and welcome back to another episode of Aliens. My name is Saiken and today we're going to have a good old mission in Dark Descent. Um, we're going to return back to the Dead Hills. Understood. Oh yeah. Uploading mission data. And did we <clears throat> leave a few tools? Yes and yes. So how about we're just landing here? And how about we're collecting the tools? Then drive over here, get the mat stuff. And we got something else in the clinic here as well. Okay, no, we're going there. Let's build our SWAT. Um, so we got uh, Xenopath, Natalia, uh, Fiddler, uh, all from the first mission. And then now Afterburner is joining them being good old disobedient. I don't like uh, that. Two of you guys should take mines. And can we get something else? We already used the wider clip upgrade. Let's select what we are going to bring with us. The sentry gun makes sense. We'll take... Actually nothing because we have left some of the stuff behind. So might as well that we're collecting a few more, a few more items. Let's be greedy as we already know the scene on the route quite well. And off we go. So we start at a 68% mission completion. I like the idea of coming back to missions. That means you don't need to do them in one go. You you can return to the crime scene afterwards. Listen up, squad. And we are even outside of alien detection range. So. How about placing a mine here? Good, we got our mine placed there. Move on. On it. We take that, thank you. We take that, thank you. We take that, thank you. And was there anything else? I believe the answer is no. Move, move. Good, everybody moves out. Got the first Xeno. barely made it out fantastic without getting uh, spotted redeploying to here so the xenomorphs are slowly but surely spawning again And I think we need to go to the warehouse as well. Good, as long as we're not being spotted out, I think that the Xenometer will stay low. Come on, team! 
Got something on a tracker. Good anything else we need to do here? No. Let's see what's inside. Next up we're dropping ourselves over here. Good, and we got a solid two and two, two tools and two medical supplies. And we started with nothing, so that's good. I like that. Redeploying over here. It's quiet. Too quiet. Okay. Just collecting some of the stuff. The game definitely brings out hoarder tendencies in me. Placing another mine here. Planting mine. Watch your feet. Mine's activated. There's something around. We could be searching for days. We could. Or we could interrogate the quartermaster's record terminal instead. Good. Nothing. Well, let's double check. Nothing. Nothing. No, wait. I've got something. It's like some of these colonists have a sideline in smuggling. This guy's working at the power complex. Check this place out, Marines. I'm marking the location. Okay, what do we... Oh, over there. All right. Come on, team. Hurry up. Of course, one Xeno is patrolling the area. Okay, let's move over. Quiet. It didn't see us. Yep, one Xeno is following us. Ugly freaking place. They're built to last, not to look nice. Let's find that equipment stash. Roger. Planning mine. Watch your feet. Just in case it follows us. Mine's activated. Let's hope the mines are killing them with one shot. It's quiet. Too quiet. Let's see what's inside. Move on. Hurry up, squad. Okay, let's be careful again. Other side here. Planting another mine. Planting mine. Watch your feet. Mine's activated. Got nothing. Let's see what's inside. Okay, this here would be a shelter room if needed. And we're full, uh, full tools. That is awesome. Body here. Can be our smuggler. Is there anything on the body? Hey, I found something. Looks like a data pad. Affirmative. Let's the transformer station. Hunsley, do you have eyes on that from up there? Yeah, oh wow! Look at that. So many crates. Okay, we eliminated uh, one of the Xenos. Let's see what's inside. The mine apparently has not uh, triggered any alarm. Alright, 
I start liking mines. Planning mine. Watch your feet. Mines activated. Got something on a track. Okay, back to the uh to our to our car. Need to get up there next. Still a bit short on medical supplies. On, but not ultra move, short, move. we're okay. Redeploy, we want to get up there. It's seen us. Oh yeah, don't miss me. Oh, uh, yeah. that's not good. The hive has launched a hunt means we have actually been spotted out but we're uh, moving somewhere else so the hive is not going to follow us but every detection raises the uh, their level Okay, well, so far that worked very well. Sergeant Harper, what? 160 resources? Nice. Turns out the chips of several citizens, including McNeil and Gallagher, disappeared next to an old mine. If there's still Trimonite in there, you must be messing with the PDT signal. Exactly, which means more might be alive down there. All right, Marines. Administrator Hayes just found us a new shining objective. She needs that director and we need that vet. We're making a detour through that mine. Really, Sergeant? Caving? Thank God I'm only flying with you lot. Don't push me, Hunslet, or I'll drag you in those tunnels myself. Open that door, Marine. I like the banter. Real Marine banter. Copy. All right, let's see what's in there. Dead aliens, but also dead miners. Fighting these beasts with shovels, harsh language, and pickaxes. Might as well shoot yourself. Affirmative. Disgusting. Got him. They look attacked to me. Good. There is definitely the option uh, for another tool here. Which means we can find some shelter. So far, we're like thirty percent. Come on, team. Thirty percent um, unhappy, stressed. Safe position taken. On it. Good. More tools. More ammunition here. Let's see what's inside. Motion tracker. Setting up motion tracker. Okay, I think we're going activated. to play it safe and are taking a short break. I take the stress levels very, very serious. And 30% is not 0%, which could mean if we're getting into a fight that could already escalate so we're going back to our tried and true room where we can weld ourselves in and just take a chill pill Double 
Apparently someone has been triggering a mine here. Roger. Planting mine. Watch so might as well plant another one. Mine's activated. And an alien is roaming uh, the location up there. So our car needs to destroy uh, destroy that first. Without us getting spotted, if possible. Very good. Stay frost. And since I don't appreciate uh, those types of visits, let's plant Plans another mine. mine. Watch your feet. Mine's activated. There's something around. Weld that door. Good, welding it uh, shut, and unfortunately the stress also does not decrease over time. It only seems to be going up. Good. Let's Got just break the world. Open up Sesame. Got something on a track. Door open. Come on, team. Hurry up, squad. On it. Planting another one here. Planting mine. Watch your feet. Mine's activated. Mainly trying to uh, reduce the number of aliens. Um, if they come out, they should immediately die. It seems that unlimited numbers are respawning, but if uh, you don't increase the stress level of the hive, it seems to stay relatively calm. And everything that indirectly kills them so specifically mines um, automatic sentries and whatnot appears to be a good solution Go down to the mine level shaft. Oh, you know, there are these situations in games where you already are aware this is going to be a bad idea, but you're going to do it anyways because the storyline sort of needs to progress. Going deeper and deeper into the lair of the beast. Charming, really. Keep that line clear, squad. It's already hard enough to hear you with all that trimonite around. I'll try to adjust comms to those caves, but keep your eyes peeled. Let's establish a safe on, parameter. Roger. Planning mine. Watch your feet. Mine's activated. Move, move. Okay. So what do we ha have down here? Medical ammunition. Let's see what's inside. Let's see what's inside. Can't plant too many mines. Unfortunately, our command points are not we'll regenerating that fast. We do have xenomorphs on the uh, radar. Not good. Move, move. OK, 
Can we wait these guys out? Get a motion tracker just so that we have a better oversight of what's happening here. Motion tracker activated. On my way. Let's see what's inside. More signatures spotted. Come on, team. Survived. Oh, unfortunate. Double time. More signatures spotted. Good. We can't stay here forever. Good, let's try our luck getting down this hallway. Hurry up, clubs. Drone spotted. Quiet. It didn't see us. Right now. Planting an another one. This is an entrance where they are spawning. Move on. I have multiple signals. Let's see what's inside. Double time. Close. Yeah, it's a xenomorph. I have multiple signals. Come on, team. Planting mine. Watch your feet. Wow. More of them. Mine's activated. Here's one. Drone spotted. Move, move! Look at that thing on the wall. This place freaks me out. I didn't sign up for this. That substance. Busy little creatures. Enough sightseeing. Stay focused. They can come from anywhere. Stay frosty, Marines. Deploying motion another tracker. beacon here. Setting a motion tracker. Motion tracker activated. Move on. 
good. There seems to be kind of a way down here we need to move around and hope to not get spotted out. I have multiple signals. Uh, there's the second one. good let's move away here we got injured we don't have a lot of extra points and we need to get away all right heal and heal stay still gonna patch you up There you go. Let's see what's inside. Hmm. Yeah. Not sure how I could have played that much better. Very hard to get uh, by them. Oh, no, 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 no. No, no, no. All right. If there is something dangerous incoming... Then let's Deploying sentry do this here. Sentry almost ready. Sentry activated. Shh, listen. I think we're good. And this here, just in case Planning there's nine. another Watch big feet. fat alien coming to us. Mine's activated. Move on. Come on, I need more command points. We could ring an alarm down here at any point. Got something on a tracker. Okay, hmm. How much damage does such a mine deal? Pretty decent damage. On my way. Planning mine. Watch your feet. Mine's activated. Hurry up, squad! I have multiple signals. Yeah, more of them are starting to spawn, so can't pull uh, pull that out forever. Once we're at two points, I would say we're going to engage. Got a sentry here. Yeah, we're okay, ish. I have multiple signals. signature spotted good these guys are going to run there instead of coming to us come on team okay got two points and let's open this in there yeah don't run over across your own mind dudes 
Oh no. I should have gotten the flamer. Oh no, that's a queen's body. Way, how are we it's even bigger in the slaughterhouse? One light it up. How are we going to kill that beast? Hurry up, squad. Bring him down. Suppressive fire. Let there be light. Okay, well then we need tactical more tactical points. Grenade! And more points. This is not exploding. Take a breath. Watch that stress, squad. Check your vitals, squad. Oh yeah, don't miss for me. Who else wants some? Okay, are we good? I hope so. Upgrade? Okay, pick up. Packing sentry gun. There's something around. Come on, team. Hurry up, squad. Ain't coming. Shit, that thing's far off. The hive is resting. Be careful. Could at least, at least uh, the um, mines have uh, worked very well. Massive onslaught closing in. Points. We are out of tools. Good job, squad. That was the last of them. Natalia is down. Wow. Stay still. Could patch you up. They lost your track, squad. Good job. Shit, we have no more 
Options to get uh, the sentry gun up. He didn't make it. God damn it! Does he? Does he have his codes on him? Yep. Patch and crew sock. Okay, got it. Opening the importation log right now. Hold on. This could take a few minutes. Got a survivor. All right, squad. We've done what we could. Join me for extraction. Sergeant, wait. If we want to learn more about that infestation, we should collect some samples on that specimen. It looked unique. A laying creature, perhaps. Well, we saw how they jumped to save the big critter. Must be really special to them. I guess it's worth a try. Go get that sample, Marines. Hey, man. If that ever happens to me, just shoot me, okay? Okay, let's get out of here. Move on. Hurry up, you slums. It's seen us. Shit. Let's rock. Suppressive fire. They're headed our way. Tango down. No more points. Technically, we do have some. Alright, move, 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 move. Oh god, we're taking a lot of damage. Afterburner, you need to heal. And we need to heal you. Don't move. I'm gonna fix you up best I can. There you go. I hate this job. Good, we're down to <laughs> zero meds. Hope the good doctor enjoys his meal. Nice work, squad. We're green for extraction. Massive stress on, levels. Team. Double time. Repair and pick up. Get up, sweetie. There's a crusher somewhere. Be careful. More signals incoming. Sentry gun fixed. Okay, we just need to stay out of uh, the firing line. Wait. You lost me. Does this your help? Come on. Don't want to trigger more. Move on. We're now down to two command points because people are distressed. Copy. Damn it. Gotta lose some weight. Hang in there, man. But I need sight, so deploy let's deploy. Uh, let's deploy a token. Setting a motion tracker. Motion tracker activated. There's something around. Move on! Hurry up, you slug! On my way. More signatures spotted. Let's Good, we're getting at least that. some first aid. Some more ammunition. Retribution, let's go.
Let's do some fast healing here. Don't move. Gonna fix you up best I can. Repair and pick up. Get up, sweetie. And how far are we? Good yeah. Well, Damn it's not going to get any better. Sentry gun fixed. Ah, disgusting. Some Xeno samples. Got it. They look intact to me. Got something on the track. Grab whatever we can and then get out of here. We have one more, uh, one command point, and that's all we got. Everybody is like super scared. Got another tool. And first floor, yes, thank you. Oh, we need to rest. mission uh, and that's just the first mission I don't understand why the director allowed that container into Dead Hill Ports of Habit I guess it says here that Craig came from Berkeley's docks not much of a clue everything comes from that spaceport well at least we have our next stop first, strike survivors okay Come on. we're still Come fine on. here so we need to heal. Get in. Get secure. Just got the achievement. Uh, do mis uh, survive mission one. I am now proud owner of that achievement. Good. Let's get down with the stress levels. Unfortunately, have no mats left, but we can reduce the stress twice. Oh yeah, well, Natalia even got downed, and these uh, aliens were trying to extract her. 
drag her back into the hive. I wonder if you can, uh, kind of uh, get a, a situation like in XCOM, where at a later s uh, mission you can uh, get your survivors uh, back, but I think that's not going to happen, I believe. The marines are simply dead in that case. Move. Move. Move on. All right, well, that you shall not pass, fuckers. Door welded. They can't get in, right? But what now? Good. Let's rest. What are you waiting for? Breakfast in bed? Cut that door open. Opening the weld. We're at least back to two command points. Weld it back uh, together. Door secure. They can't get in, right? What now? We're resting. Good. There is some very minor stuff over here that I would like to get before we're leaving. Just healing up uh, these guys. I don't know if it makes a difference. Potentially it does not. I don't know what to think about the mines. I thought they were like one uh, shot kills for the small uh, for the smaller or for the normal aliens, but that apparently is not the case. So I'm torn whether or not to use them. The motion sensors are super helpful, but uh, I can't. I don't have enough uh, command points to just deploy motion sensors and mines all over the place. Some more meds, and I know that we had meds in here. Decontamination process engaged. Processing. Processing. Decontamination complete. On it. Let's see what's inside. Okay. Like it didn't happen. All we need to do now is get out of here. I would guess. It's Let's not going to trigger the swarm a second time. Decontamination process engaged. Processing. Processing. Decontamination complete. Very good. Cool. So we even got uh, one, one more healing done. And that means we can finally extract Got the Project Blueprint here, got 18 Xeno samples, we got two sentry guns, which is great. 
So I think overall it was fine, although I I believe I messed up kind of the middle section. The fight against the Queen was surprisingly good, but then we got flanked uh, from the side. Ninety-nine percent. Well, we we were missing one data pad. Oh, that's okay. Oh well, four days in Mad Bay, six days in Mad Bay. Uh, Ibohondurek doesn't have medical supplies. Uh, he takes stress damage. Okay, how do we get rid of that? Paranoid, depressive. Boom. Oh, okay. Xenotaph uh, has reached rank 3. Uh, we can either be sergeant or attacker. The sergeant is the keystone to a squad, charismatic team leader with a strategic mindset. As long as the marine with attribute is alive or marine get uh, bravery bonus. That's good. And he gets the revolver as a secondary weapon. Okay. And here we got the attacker. Undoubtedly the most intelligent member. Tacker is clever resource for Marine. Uh, grants the hack interaction option. Ability to unlock uh, encrypted doors, but that costs tools and I don't like that. Uh -uh. Sergeant it is. And he had looter, 10% more materials, that's good. Uh, Marine is no longer a tie. Oh, oh, that is good. See, I don't understand it. The smart ass per perk seems to be also like the tacker. Why would you go tacker when you do have smart ass? I might be missing something there. A recon or gunner. Fast and equipped with a light pulse rifle, the Recon is a deadly master scout who can always be rallied upon with their squad. Weapon training, uh, revolver and sniper rifle. Hmm, sniper rifle sounds good. Oh yeah, but Gunner, I remember them. Vasquez from, uh, uh, from Aliens too. She was a Gunner. And I think Natalia looks a little bit like Vasquez. Natalia... You are becoming a, ga a gunner. Uh, is already brave. Mind of speed, steel. Automatically heals one trauma point. Okay. Sure. That sounds good. But tough also sounds pretty damn good. She already has less stress, so I think this would be doubling. We want to get her to become tough. Hmm. It's not bad. I mean, hit points are never bad. Or uh, do we want traumas to go away? Unfortunately, I need to make the decision now. I don't want smart as. Uh, it's either tough or mind of steel. I tell you what, I don't know how bad traumas are, so it fits her character. Definitely, this is a trauma. Good, fiddler. Medic or tacker. Experts in keeping the squad in good shape. Medic's vital. Duration of healing interaction is reduced by 50%. Okay. And here we have the taker. You know, I like medic, so I will give it a try. Taker, welcome. You are our medic. And has the ability to critically uh, disassemble enemies. That's not bad. 
Mind of Steel, trauma reduction is good, or fast. The whole uh, squad moves faster. I think we want to do that. Everybody moves faster, super good. And then afterburner. Uh, let's do unbreakable will. Seems like a good choice. Inventory report. We rescued a physician. That is good. Got a tool, got a medical supply, two sentries, lots of sample, uh, lots of material, and quite a bit of Xeno sample, plus a extraction device blueprint. Okay. See, this time we were way more trapped, hunted, and you name it. Kill the queen, kill the crusher. If we already fight the queen in, this, in the first mission, then something is... Uh, I don't want to know what is going to come next. You did good today, Administrator. Not good enough. We need to broadcast, or more colonies will end up like dead hills. Ease down. We have no proof of that. What we have is a lead. That container transited from Berkeley's dock. That's Lethe's main spaceport. Someone's dispatched those crates on purpose. What kind of psycho would do that? Sergeant? We've seen those things in action. You know we don't have time to chase boxes. Oh, but we have time to build our own private satellite? Listen, Martinez reckons the surviving EEV can be repaired. We rig it with boosters and a comms repeater, maintain it in low orbit, push a message to a working relay, and we can- Did you listen to what I just said? Somebody used that container so the Dead Hills could live up to its name. What if there's more of those crates around, huh? As this Director Price of yours still isn't taking any calls, we're the only one trying to find where they came from. If we don't, more folk are gonna die. And even more if no one ever hears about what happened on this damn planet. If you really want to save everyone, Sergeant Harper, I suggest you start thinking beyond Lethe. I was born here, Hayes. These are my people. I won't leave them to die. I didn't know. I mean, I'm sorry, Sergeant. Listen, you're right. Berkeley's a big spaceport. We'll probably find both people and quality spare parts there. I say we catch them both. Roger that. But in the meantime, can you check in with Becker? He's been pestering me like you wouldn't believe. Whew. Okay, well, before we go to the laboratory, let's go to the Mad Bay. Xenopath, we do have three physicians and Afterburner is out for six days. How do we get rid of... How do we get rid of uh, the phobias? So you... Definitely need intense care. Natalia needs intense care. And Fiddler needs intense care. Cool. With that extra doctor, we're, uh, we've done good because uh, we can now reduce uh, the Back. impact of being Dr. ill. Becker, you wanted to see me? Indeed, I did. That specimen you've recovered offered outstanding research possibilities. Have you had the chance to review my initial report on the Xeno samples? I've barely slept. Oh, yes. Of course. Well, suffice to say, they're absolutely fascinating. I feel my muse gathering herself to action. All manner of breakthroughs tantalized just beyond my fingertips. Long-term benefits aside, I've already had some ideas about how to improve our gallant marines' equipment. But I need more samples. These creatures are dangerous, Doctor. Not when they're dead. And if we took one alive? Well, nothing's impossible. This lab has a containment cell built for <laughs> such encounters. Perhaps we could use it. A live specimen? On board? A absolutely not. I'm simply trying to make myself useful. Listen, Doctor, I, I get it. But the Marines will stick with samples, and so should you. 
We can't have one of those things getting loose on here. Okay, so uh, laboratory is now ready to conduct a new research um, project. Select the stasis grenade. I don't want the stasis grenade. Chitin um, Kevlar plates passively increases the armor points of the whole squad. Uh, that looks like Probably something we would want. Project worthy of my talents. Stasis grenades. Improves grenades every time caught in a grenade explosion. Suffer 50% penalty to movement speed for a short period of time. It only costs three. That's an study, easy buy. I may say so myself. And extraction de uh, device. The squad gains uh, the embryo extraction uh, interaction option, allowing you to heal a marine from a face hugger uh, implantation. Uh oh, okay. Well, okay, we need more samples. Hello, Administrator. Good. Then we do have extra weapons in the workshop. So, smart gun. That is the gunner. Oh yeah, we need that. Uh, four ammo. 150 ammo. Long duration, but oh my god, that's dealing a lot of damage. Let's hope our mat won't sue us. Okay, that's a no-brainer. Revolver d does way more damage uh, than a service pistol. And the other option is incendiary unit. Uh, incinerator unit, but that's a special weapon, so it will cost us... Hmm. I don't know, I mean, listen. I'm the first guy who who loves uh, flamethrowers. Uh, I like them in Aliens. They were always super good. But I'm not sure if that's the right play. Let's get the revolver. And for now we're fine. Heavy pulse rifle is level six required and plasma rifle is level 10 marine. Yeah, okay, good, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, we're going with pulse rifles and smart gun for now. Because that's how we roll. someone in particular. This one won't let you down. Oh, cool. We got new upgrades. So the sergeant can go with a radio backpack. As long as the marine with this attribute is alive. Oh, maximum command points plus one. That is helpful. As long as the marine is alive. Command points regenerate 10 seconds faster oh oh okay that's definitely worth it i'm using a lot of them um bravery increases got that accuracy is definitely worth it pouches is definitely worth it and wider clip seems to be worth it as well but before we buy anything let's check what else we can do i think for now the day is over yeah i i purchased a lot of weapons i don't want to spend all New Let's go to the next day. One of the scientists accidentally spread acid in his face. Mm. 
we lose a day with the Marines or we maybe permanently lose a physician. Hmm. It's only a 30% chance that he's, uh, that he's, but we need them. Uh, all right. I've played too much, too much XCOM, 30%. Medical quarters. Deputy Administrator Hayes. But we couldn't have put them into service today anyway, so might as well use all of our medical stuff next day to get those three ready. So he is still exhausted for one more day, so she's also not available, which means we're going to uh, take a look at the other Marines, I suppose. Have a nice day. Okay, we've pretty much gotten the most out of it. What exactly does the incinerator do? Any class? Good range. Needs a level two marine, so it doesn't matter for our next mission See because we don't have a level two marine ready. So we're not going to unlock it for the have next nice mission. Day. In the meantime, what did I teach you, Marine? Salute. Let's purchase a couple of updates. I like the radio backpack, but before we do that, let's see what the other options this are. Won't let you down. Fiddler. Grants reanimation interaction option to heal another Marine in a coma. Okay. Increases the health points of all Marines in the squad by one. Ooh. That's actually pretty damn good. And that is pretty damn good as well. So he also reduces stress on top of healing. Not sure if I would take that, but definitely combat drugs and poucher um, seems good as well. What did I teach you, Marie? So what can a gunner take? Uh, allows Marine to deploy smart gun as an autonomous sentry. We already have sentries. Advanced tracking system increases the uh, Marine's accuracy. On enemies targeted by kill that bastard. What is kill that bastard? Ten points for enemies targeted with kill that bastard or aiming just five points. Increase the slowing effect of suppressing fire uh, from the whole squad. Ooh, that is good as well. That is good as well. I like the passive bonuses. Yeah, they all do have really good stuff. Um, this one won't let you down. Let's use the upgrades now, because um, multiple reasons actually. Last time that I bought everything, I then was um, asked to purchase an upgrade and the game gave me 50 extra resources. So I think just like XCOM, there is a benefit in actually spending the stuff. So 
More command points are helpful. We want that. And that extra command point regeneration is super helpful. Good. Then. What did I teach you, Marine? Salute. Combat uh, stims. One extra uh, hit point for all Marines as long as uh, we're alive. Fabulous. Love it. This one won't let you down. And here we're taking increased slowing effect for the whole squad. Okay, so that's already good. We do have one more that we can pick. I teach you, Marine. Salute. And I think what I would like to do is this one won't let you down. take poacher one uh, one time or pouches. Good. The next upgrade here is level six and then level ten. But we already have more. Um, more ammunition so he's not going to run out he's uh, helping everybody and uh, pouches is good as well uh, the stress reduction might be something uh, that is going to be interesting not a hundred percent sure so if i want that um, for her she already has wider clip so here i would actually like to get uh, aiming so that uh, she hits more often and thus more damage because uh, she does have the smart gun and he can't carry that but the cool part is the revolver seems to work for everyone as a good secondary weapon. Okay, very good. We got mines. And I think we're equipped for now. The three level three characters also do have a few skills, which I think is helpful. I'm not sure if I should invest in them, but it feels like we have uh, gotten a lot of weapon upgrade so I think we're fine with that and we got uh, the Kevlar so that is one extra armor and we got one hit point from Fiddler if he's being taken up so that's another day of defense plus if Xenopath is with us that'll give us more command points and quicker command point regeneration so all of that for me screams like things are good what I haven't understood is how to get rid of the squad doesn't have uh, uh -huh. how do we how do we get rid of that hypochondriac Natalia already due to her mental strength got rid of it maybe I should just skill that for everyone when they offer it just to get the trauma uh, uh, the trauma away And also that tiredness is a good, uh, let's, let's try to get the traits where they are never becoming tired. That seems a, like a good trait. Because one of our characters is uh, very much exhausted at the moment. And after burnout, it'll take some time until you are back, buddy. Uh, next day, 
all three will be available. I have no idea how to deal with um, those negative states. Marine starts every mission with 30 stress. Sucks. Yeah. But both are manageable. All right. Anyways, end of today's uh, episode. Thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, as always, if you like Alien Dark Descent, leave me a message and a little comment. Plus a like down below. And we see each other in the next episode. Bye-bye.